Hello learners, this is the video solution for the question number 2 in the week 5 graded assignment for computational thinking. The question reads, the following pseudo code is executed on the words table. Assume that the rows in table 1 are sorted in the increasing order of sequence number. What does the list L contain at the end of execution? Getting into the code, we see that an empty list is assigned to variable L, none value is assigned to variable A, and then we read the first row X in table 1, assign the part of speech of this particular row to A, and move this row to table number 2. Now, while table 1 has more rows, we read the first row X in table 1. And if the part of speech of this row is a noun, we then check if A, which was the part of speech of the previous row, was an adjective. And then we take the word in the current row and append it to the list L. Then we exit the nested if statements and assign the part of speech of the current row to variable A and move the current row to table number 2 and the loop continues. So what is the logic here? The logic states that if the part of speech of the current row is a noun and if the part of speech of the previous row was an adjective, only then will the word of the current row be appended to the list or be added to the list. So if we look at the options, we can clearly see that the first option which states the list of nouns that come immediately after an adjective is the correct answer. Thank you learners.